hello everyone welcome back to the video series on clinical SAS programming so few of the users have asked me to explain the creation of standard result variables in sdtm findings domains so we will try to see that concept using vital science as an example here so we know that in sdtm findings domain the results are present in two different formats the one is original results and the second one is standard results so when we do not have the standard results coming from the input data set we need to employ some algorithm or logic to derive the standard results using the original results and original result units so for each test there will be a standard result unit that has to be presented in the sdtm data sets and the collection may occur in the same unit as the standard or in different units so when they are not the same so we need to employ some logic to convert them to standard units so here in this example so we have vital signs height and weight is being collected so the standard result unit for height is centimeter and for weight it is kg so if you take a look at the first record and the height the original result unit is reported in meters so which means the original result value reported in VSORRES which is 1.68 is in terms of meters but the standard result unit for that height test CD is centimeters so we need to convert this 1.68 meters to centimeter value so that is the that is what we call as like conversion of original result to standard result units or deriving or creation of standard results so on the second record if we see the standard result unit for weight test cd is kg but the result is collected on this record in lb which is pounds so here we have 138.9 pounds needs to be converted to kg value so which means we need a conversion factor from converting this 138.9 to kg value and if you take a look at the third record which is for height again so if you see the original result unit itself is centimeter which is equivalent to the VSST RESU so in this case all we need to do is like multiply this number with one so that the standard result will remain the same as original result so again on the last record if you see the unit weight is collected in kgs which is 60.5 on this record and the standard result unit for this is also uh, for weight is kg so we can just keep or carry forward this value to the vsstresn so how do we convert this original result to standard result so in most of the cases we would be given an excel file or a sas data set containing the different possible original results for each of the units and a conversion factor or multiplier that has to be multiplied to the original result unit to get the standard result unit so here we have the sample data set that is being given so for each test so for here two we have two test series height and weight so height if it is collected in meters so in order to convert it to the standard result unit centimeter we need to multiply the value with 100 so and if the height collected itself is centimeter as the original uh, standard result unit is also centimeter all we need to do is multiply it with the number one and similarly for weight when the original result unit is lb in order to convert it into the standard result unit of kg we need to multiply the original result value with a value of 0.4536 and similarly when it is the weight is collected in terms of the standard result unit which is kg all we need to do is multiply it with value 1 so if an excel file is given so we can import and convert it into a sas data set and if a sas data set is actually directly given we can merge this data set to the vital science data set at test cd and original result unit in this case and to fetch the multiplier for each of that and if neither sas data set nor excel file is given so we can write some if then else logics to create this conversion multiplier factors something like if test cd is equal to height and or or esu is equal to meters 
so then conversion multiplier is equal to 100 a new variable can be created conditionally based on the test cd and the original result unit so let's assume that it is being given in the form of a sas data set all we need to do is like merge this data set to the parent data set at test cd and original result unit to face the conversion multiplier so we will get a data set that looks like this so we will have conversion multiplier for each of the row that is applicable based on the test cd and the original result unit that is collected so once we get the conversion multiplier all we need to do is convert this vs orres into a temporary numeric variable and can multiply it with the conversion multiplier variable to get the vs st re sn so once we have the standard result numeric variable we can use put function or something similar to convert it into standard result character variable here in this case the standard result character variable will be vs st re sc so so here is the piece of code so i'll leave the description for uh, i'll leave uh, the link to this post which is available on the site in the description of this video so once we uh, do this merging process and after getting the conversion multiplier and converting the stand, uh, original result to standard result unit so we get the vsst resn variable which looks like this so 1.68 was supposed to be multiplied with 100 so we get a value of 168 in one vsst resn similarly so weight of uh, 138 point nine was multiplied with the conversion factor which was 0.4536 which is rounded to 0.454 so we'll get the unit in terms of kgs so this is how we can convert original result to standard results in any findings domains using conversion factors thank you for watching and keep learning